Hello, this is Marcus from Open Remote. Today I want to give a small demonstration to um, show our uh, IP to Z-Wave protocol. Uh, we're using the home scenario uh, IP to Z-Wave bridge and uh, I'm controlling a few devices with this. Um, there's a door contact, a movement sensor, a normal light switch and a Z-Wave dimmer. Um, right now we're supporting the switch device and the dimmer device and the door contact and the movement sensor. They're just acting as switches. They have a status on or off. So, because um, I was just moving my hands around over there, the door movement sensor says on. Oh, just turned off. I can open the door. We can see on the user interface the door is open. We can close the door. The door is closing, turn the light on, there we go, go with the dimmer to 50% and this is also indicating uh, the switch of the dimmer, go to 100% and we turn the light off again, there we go, turn the light off, always takes a little while until the Z-Web gateway is uh, sending the new status updates to uh, open remote. I'll put my hand on the movement sensor, the movement sensor goes on, we can open up the door again, we can turn the light on, we turn the light off, after 15 seconds of no movement the movement sensor will indicate an off, there should be coming any, there we go. And then I'll close the door again. And there we are. So this was a small demonstration of the Z-Wave IP support. And uh, you can find more information on our website. I will put up a um, to-do how to configure this. Thank you very much.